Hello children, good morning everybody. Welcome to our channel Smart Study. In the previous class I forgot to discuss the bits of the ninth lesson, right? See, we shall discuss now. Zooming it. Yes. See, a bit is what, Nana? Tick the correct choice. First question. This animal can camouflage. Means it can change its color. Camouflage means what? That one. Okay, which can change its color according to the surroundings. What is it? Vulture, hippo. That means hippopotamus, chameleon. So, what is the answer, Nana? You all know. Chameleon. C, B, T is the answer. Now, moving to the second one. These animals live on the land. Aquatic animals, terrestrial animals, aerial animals. Which animal lives on the land, Nana? Terrestrial animals. Third one herbivorous animals have well developed biting teeth tearing teeth grinding teeth herbivorous animals will be having the biting teeth okay fourth one when in water a frog breathes through its so when the frog is in the water it will breathe with the help of what they are asking what is the answer skin when it is on the land it will be breathing with the help of the lungs they are asking when it is in the water in water it will be breathing with the help of the skin this is very important and check whether they are asking on the water or on the land and tick the answer it is a flesh eating bird parrot eagle sparrow which is a flesh eating bird eagle so bb it is the answer yes now moving to the fill in the blanks see here the natural home of an animal is called its dash habitat so what is the answer nana habitat i have already written here h a b i t a t this is i okay h a b i t a t habitat i am saying you can listen the answer second one fish breathe through their dash fish will sorry fish will breathe with the help of their what gills what is the spelling of the gills nana g i l l s g i l l s double l okay third one when an animal sleeps for several months to protect itself from cold it is called as the hibernation in the question answers i have discussed long answer okay an animal which sleep for several anim sorry several months to protect itself from cold is called what hibernation h i b e r hiber n a t i o n hibernation these all words are there in the hard words you can check okay if you refer the textbook also you can get the animals that hunt other animals are called as a predators yes or no so the animals which hunt the other animals are called predators p r e d a t o r s predators fifth one the living organism on which a parasite feeds is called as host i told for you in the parasite okay so the, the living organism on which a parasite feeds that means eats is called as what host spelling of host is what nana h o s t host clear Yes, now moving to the C bit. True or false? See here. First one, frogs can breathe both on land and in water. Yes, it is true. Yes or no, the frogs can live both on the land and also on the water. Second one, a tiger will die in a desert because it is not adopted to live in a desert. Yes, tiger cannot live in desert because in desert it will be very hot so camels can live in the deserts why because their skin will be very thick and they can bear that weather but tiger is not adopted to live in the desert so it cannot survive there survive means live so it cannot live there so they told it is right so second answer is also true moving to the third one all animals protect themselves only by running away from their enemies no some can fly also in different ways they will be protecting from the enemies so it is false third one is what false fourth one the animals hunted by the predators are called as the prey yes correct so the animals which are hunted by the predators are called as prey only no i told for you cheetah and deer example cheetah is a predator and deer is a prey fifth one Porcupines have sharp spines on their body to protect themselves. They are saying that porcupines will be having the sharp spines on the body to protect themselves. Yes, I told you like thorns it will be there and they can protect from themselves by the spines. It is true. Only third one is false. Nana. Remaining all are true. Clear? Yes. Now moving to the last bit. See here I am zooming it. Matching. Match the following. Left side they have given see what they have given carnivores, herbivores, omnivores, scavenger, parasites. Right side you need to match with the animal. Okay. Carnivore means what? Then a flesh eating animal. That means lion. First option is C. I am writing here. First one is C. Carnivore is a lion. Second one is herbivore. Herbivore is what? Deer. 
so herbivore means plant eating animals that is d e c e okay next third one omnivore means it will eat the both the plants and the flesh that is bear crow i told so here they have given bear so third option is what bear that is b option next scavenger scavenger means the animals which eat the dead animals i told for you vulture jackal hyena so here they are given the example of vulture so fourth one is what nana d moving to the last one parasite parasite means they will be sucking the blood from the living organisms like leech hookworm i told you know so parasite example is what leech here a so your options are c e b d a again i am repeating first one is c second is e third one is b fourth is d and fifth one is a clear by this we have completed the bits also in the next class i'll come with the other new lesson and